Hello everybody, welcome back to more Nova Drift. We are probably going to play around with this mod if we can make it happen. I don't know, there's going to be a point sometime very soon where we're just going to we're going to play and whatever happens happens, but uh Viper sounds very interesting. I I'm going <laughs> to we'll read that as we go. But we have a new uh, a new hull and a new or a new body, I guess I could say, and a new uh shield. Waves advance faster. Maybe. Bosses become more powerful. Maybe. I don't know. It's an extra 25% to score if we care about that. You know what? Let's give it a shot. Let's give it a shot. If it's not too bad, then we just get a whole bunch of extra points. And it won't change the difficulty for the, the vast majority of the time that we're playing. So what's up with this? Depl we, we got it last time. Deploy a bar projectile that lodges in the targets. Cause, yeah, caustic payload. I gotcha. Damage is blast damage. Start seal their damage as burn damage. Deals 1% burn damage per level per total darts lodged in. Plus 1% burn damage. Brace duration of 2 seconds. Modified by size and ignite duration. I mean, I'm sure we could do something with that. What about, like, a charge Monstro's Lung Dart situation? I know we just used this before, but it's a brand new weapon. So, I feel like it might be a... <laughs> just nicked him. Uh, it's a brand new weapon to us, so I think it might be kind of fun. What do we got here? All right. Uh, where is it? Siphon is a new shield for us. Siphon deals 120 base damage per second divided by... Between the enemies within its radius, okay, of course, recovering 1.5% of the damage as shields, while Siphon deals damage, your shield effect power and effect radius are increased, deals 400 extra percent damage to enemy shields. Okay. So while they're in this radius, we, we do a slow kill upon them. And it restores our HP as well a little bit. I mean, yeah, I don't know. If we're going to be doing something with a good old monster's lung, like a charge up scatter shot kind of a thing, then that seems like that might be pretty decent. Let me read this now. Protected by a caustic barrier, which charges over time and provides 90% head on hull crash damage resistance, charges up to do that, and 10% hull damage resistance. Okay. When you crash head on, it delivers its payload, igniting the target for a duration, scaling with the charge level. Which then resets. When you take a hull hit, you disgorge Venom Strike, which projects towards the offender. The Venom Strike projectiles deal 90% burn damage and ignite targets for 45 burning damage, plus 20% ignite duration. I mean, that seems really, uh, really, really solid for us. So does this scale with ignite duration? Base duration modified by ignite duration. Okay, so this is actually kind of like a... Uh, as far as I'm aware, this seems sort of like a logical, cohesive-ish build. So, I mean, that sounds interesting. Um, charge shot, though. What is that under? That's under... Okay, it's under magnitude charge shot. Sure, we'll, we'll give it a shot. I don't know that it's going to be, like, good or not. But we'll just, uh, we'll see. We'll see what happens with it, right? So far, so fine, All right? Okay, so we're gonna have significantly increased boss difficulty, apparently. We will see. You are very clearly getting bodied by the damage over time there. So to that I say I apologize. Hmm. Seems like we're just gonna t die the second we take that all the time, I don't know. All right, uh, we could work on rapid fire, blast radius, splinter? Let's, let's look at it. Get out, sure. Oh, they splinter when they break. That's kind of fun. It's kind of fun indeed. We'll get this bad boy. Sure. I've been told that this is uh, better than I give it credit for, so yeah, we'll, we'll, we'll see. We will, we will see. I will be the judge of that. Hmm. 
shoot the char that's not charge shot that's payload uh Antimatter round seems like a spooky thing to go for. 20 flat damage for weapons that hit. Bonus projectile size velocity. Adds a damage muzzle blast. What? So shot right in front of us, kind of, probably. Uh, adds weapon recoil. Okay. Take heavy hull self damage when you fire. Damage is slightly increased for each additional projectile you fire. That seems terrifying. I don't know that I'm going to want that. But, oh well. We'll see. But yeah, it's interesting that these shots, they... Yeah, they, the splinter effect is only after they've... Um, they procced. Like, I get it. It makes sense. Probably get candescence. Increase the amount of time that they will be burning on the enemy. Obviously, like, it'll increase the amount of time until they uh, eventually do splinter. But, oh well. Okay, if we kill if we kill the unit they're on, they should splinter after. We do reduce our rate of fire by doing this. I know we aren't doing this right. We should like sneak behind and actually, you know, get them. So we're doing extra damage to shields, I would think, though. Oh my god, what is that? What is that? I don't know if I've ever seen that before. Our shield is gone. We can no longer use it to restore our shields. Come on! 85% uh, shield and uh, restoration. Please. Please kick it into gear. This seems like a good idea. Being able to steal shields. Steal shields from a further distance strikes me as a good idea. Okay, chase that down. Hmm. Hmm. I mean, it's it's putting in work. It's definitely doing damage. I kind of like it. It could be... So wait, we restore for part of the damage? Recovering... Yes, recovering a percentage of the actual damage. So we could... It could be an interesting thing to build into this and sort of focus on, um, like, non-direct weapon damage. We could, we could do a build with that. We could be a vampire, man. That may bite me in the butt. Everybody always yells at me because I don't properly value the, uh, the burn tree. So here we go. This is me... Hopefully, valuing the burn tree. Okay. We'll see. We're not getting our uh, our charge shot at all. There we go. Weapons the charge innately increases the charge rate along with any charge costs. Weapon damage velocity. Wait. Does this? No, it does not. Wait. Hold on. It doesn't even monsters like. I mean, we still can though. Hold on. What kind of damage does this do? Oh my god. <laughs> I can't find out because it's murdering everybody the second it touches them. Ooh. I don't know, man. I definitely don't have a, uh, a cohesive thought process for what I want going on here today. Let's do it. Okay, I mean, that guy, yeah, that guy died. That guy died real good. He died real good. I think I would like to get the thing that lets us split our damage between our hull and our shield. I'm, I pretty much almost always want that. I'm a viper. Viper! I mean, how could we get... We could get, like, a little bit of homing, I guess. That would uh, modify our... Whoop, up. Oh, you jerk. If we got a little bit of homing, that would modify our... Um, boop. Our accuracy, I guess. That's what I was going to say. All right, we finally get this guy. Let's get in there. Split the damage.
Oh, God. That's not good. That was not good at all. I don't know about this. I don't know about this at all. Oh, okay. It does do good damage. It just took a little bit. I will say my uh, my HP situation leaves a lot to be desired. Okay. I guess we can just pop that right in the uh, the side of the ship there. Boop. Oh, that. <laughs> that was a ship. Okay. Well. Can't quite hit that. There we go. That should uh, that should probably do it. That should do it. That'll do her. Should we get a big old volley? Sure. That sounds, it sounds fun to just get up in their face and then just like sting them. We're a fig, like a, like a cobra is what we are. I'm a big old cobra. Whoop. We're going to like, Punk our damage down like crazy. Um, sure. We'll reduce our spread a bit. I mean, that's pretty cool looking. That is pretty cool looking. All right, let's get stupid. We have not done this in a while. Ooh. Okay. I mean, I, I kind of like it. It's, it's it's pretty cool looking. We just jam them all in there like that. And then we can oops, jam in another. You are a shielded enemy if I've ever seen one. Okay. Get out. Big time. We are in all kinds of peril. I think we need to focus on a little bit of um, shield related stuff. Purge is obviously something. Shield cooldown. All right. Boop. Don't have to aim very well, which is uh, an added little benefit here. Good. All right. I think that'll help us because then we can use our AOE radius to actually restore our shields a little bit better. See right there? Yeah, that's working pretty well. I mean, it's not great. Like, it's not, it's not jamming. It's pretty good. We can maybe get that passively regenerating shield. That could be something. Well, we just delivered that payload right there. Also, aren't we always technically receiving hull damage, so we should always be releasing our caustic payload? That seems to be the case, which is huge if true. Mm, I don't know about that. <laughs> we, I mean, we could do that too. Wait, is that... Which radius? This radius is the one where they take the increased damage? That's wild if that's true. Because that's really easy to keep them inside. Okay. It's, it's looking like homing is not going to be something we really, really need to focus on. Which I'm happy about. Oh, no. Oh, no. We are certainly just moments away from peril at all times, though. Okay. Just two little blasts, and then we, uh, we got them stuck with... Stuck with needles for ages. Improves max hull, I mean, what would be wrong about that? Improves max shields. Okay, hold on, which one's higher? It's, it's our hull, so we would increase our hull. I kind of want to upgrade my shield 
so that when we get that again, we upgrade our shields even more. Right? Right? I don't know. I could be wrong. I could be totally off base about what would be better for this build, but I think having more shields sounds like it'd be really, really good for us. Just trying to sneak in as many of those shots as we can before danger time happens. Yep, this is spooky, but it's working. All right. Oh, caustic payload, there you go. Oh, it's like me on the Leviathan build. Oh, okay. Yeah, we are regenerating. Not at like a super fast level or anything. Master shield cooldown, lower max shields. Eh? You know, rate of fire up doesn't seem like a problem. Burst fire actually could be kind of interesting in a weird way. Bloop, bloop. Yeah, I do like that we're always technically taking that hull damage. Yes, I know it's never getting like fully charged up to its maximum potential, but like I'm okay with that at the moment. Okay. Have we gotten all the upgrades to shield power currently available? I think we might have. Uh-oh. That's not good! <laughs> oh, no. Okay. I'm watching it. Oh! All these little extras here. Get out of here. We're just tap shooting it to get as many in there. You take heavy hull damage. Why does it gotta be heavy hull damage? Ooh. A hull hit, is a hull hit different than hull damage? Is that the thing? See, that's that's maybe the thing. Maybe a hull hit is different than hull damage. I'm not sure. Let's try. Because if we do that and then we convert our sh hull to shields, then shouldn't we... It, it should be a lot easier for us to take 10% of our maximum hull as damage. So in the event that a hull hit and hull damage are the same thing, we would be really, really well off in that regard. In the event that it's not, then oh well. Oh well, then. I don't think a little bit of homing would hurt either, but... You know, we'll cross that bridge when we come to it. I sent the payload. Oh. oh my god, we are just slowly sneaking by that guy. Hoping to get him there. Maybe. I mean, I don't think we want to do that, but... Sure, let's do Death Blossom. Why not? Sounds fun, if nothing else. Same thing here. We got our little orbiting thing. Why not? There's some good upgrades. There's some good upgrades there. Ooh. I have not noticed this too big of a dif difficulty increase in the bosses. I wonder if it just means the damage they do or the, uh, the HP that they have. Because if it's the HP they have, we have a really good build for it, since I think we scale just totally fine with uh, damage over time. Seems like we would be in a really good spot for big old bosses. One would think. Oh, no. I'm trying to slowly... Please. Please. I'm a trying to live. Obviously, we could. I'm going to pick 
<laughs> I'm gonna pick some barrier here with the hopes that keeps me alive. Live. Okay, I'm actually kind of happy my shield is down in a way. I'm not happy at all about that. Ah, oh. makes you blink to your destination when you trigger strafe. Wait, what happened here? Wait, what? Oh, oh. <laughs> I was going to say. Oh, my heart hurts for that one. Like, I get it. I really wanted to convert my HP to my shields there and uh, and lean into that, but... Holy moly, I don't have time for another full run. We're going Blitz. We're going Glass Cannon, whatever that means for this. We're, we're going to turn on all of the modifiers there. We're going to turn on... Vortex. We're going to turn on. Wait. I have an idea. Where's Shockwave? It's Warp. Shockwave. I had an idea. And it's called something stupid. Okay, also, wait. What does this look like? Oh, wait. Carrier's not the one I thought it was. I was thinking this was the uh, the one where we shot from our sides. Just give me a second on the, uh, you'll, you'll see what stupid thing I have in mind. Don't worry. I got a very perfect, terrible idea. I just need to get it to show up. That's all. I, I got, I'm super... I'm super jazzed to see how bad this can actually be. What the heck, that shockwave. <laughs> but we'll have to get it first. I, I definitely, I think I might switch up my my shield or my uh, my body. I don't know that I'm too into what it, it what it is right now. I mean, like I'm happy with it, I guess, because it's probably good. It's probably way better than the garbage that I am going to show to you here today. All right, let's see what we can do. Oh, hello. Um, hello. Don't kill me, like, in the first two seconds, though. That's the malarkey. Oh, my God. I almost died. Okay, just slowly ch chunking. Yeah, our regen rate is booty. Wow, we're, we're going we're gonna to die before anything even happens. Are we, like, normally healed up by our little friends and they're just not doing their job? Okay. Oh, well, let's see. Come on, little boys. Come on, my boys, my gang, my guys. Okay, shield effect radius, slower shield cooldown. I mean, I want focus shields, if anything. Nope. I will not... No, and I'm not going to say what my build is going to be. <laughs> uh, I'm not going to say what my build will be until it shows up. Is that my shield radius? Is that my shield radius? Hold, is that how small it is? Hmm. Rear firing sounds kind of fun. I, I can't. I can't find what I want, so I might have to just say what it is. Skirmish. Sure. <laughs> I mean, that worked pretty well. That worked really well. Okay, pushing him away. 
It's a wild mod I'm, I'm looking for. If that possibly, if that stupid idea possibly is a little more obvious with that in mind, maybe it, maybe it will be. Bloop. Maybe, maybe. Death Blossom. There it is. <laughs> there it is. Yup. Come here. Come here. Come here. Where do you think you're going? Absorb all the projectiles to me. Oh. <laughs> what a bad idea. Oh my god. What is what a bad idea. I love it. Okay. We need let's see. <laughs> Sure. So we're drone specialized, which will be cool in a little bit. This is basically... I've created challenge mode. I've created a challenge mode. I'm so dead. <laughs> I'm dead immediately. I just wanted to see what would happen if... I Somebody pitched that, and I couldn't stop thinking about it. Just have a shield that slowly pulls all projectiles and enemies towards you. And see if there's a way to make it good. And the answer is probably, there probably is. Like, maybe with the fire butt build? I don't know. Let's, we'll try one more time here. Because unfortunately, wow, when you do a, uh, like a garbage build, the game ends really fast. It ends really fast. Uh, pulse? Does this push enemies away as well? I think it does. <laughs> I think it does. Siphon? I don't know. There's... Battery. This is the one I thought it was. What does this do? Plus three projectiles for projectile weapons, damage projectile size, minus spread resists knockback. What? I mean, that seems busted because who cares about the direction, right? Oh my God, that's really good. So we get a little bit of recoil for that, I guess. But it says it resists knockback. I guess that doesn't mean, like, all. Oh, my God. You know what? I think maybe we could do the build with this one, huh? This is a really good idea, though. It's like, it's just, it's just free. It's just free real estate. Oh, it's like, it's one of those ones where the penalty, boy, our thrust is not super great though. The penalty is like not that big of a penalty. Like the fact that the shots are not aimed very well doesn't really matter when it's an AOE. Oh, we do have to have, like obviously get in uh, melee range of these enemies and that's, I guess, kind of tough, I suppose. There it is, let's get stupid. I think we absorb the enemies in, which actually could be... Hold on. That could be good. Oh, my God. <laughs> it could be good. Amp. Let's get some drones. Who we will use as, like, little... Little things that will block our fool enemies for a bit. Um... Yeah, we will get that so we can split the damage between our hull and our shields for when we inevitably do switch over to Shockwave. Like, we, we pull them in so that they take more, more bullets. That's so funny. That's so funny to me. Oh, my God. Oh, 
Oh my god. <laughs> oh wait, so rear firing does matter to to an extent. This is so, so so dumb. Oh my god. What? <laughs> so stupid. So dumb. It's so dumb. I love it. Get more fire butt. We, we just get to fire two uh, whole shockwaves for free, is what's happening. Burst fire. Okay. We're, we're going to do it, and it's going to be terrible. And I cannot wait. Whoop. Uh-oh. We'll absorb them into our fire butt. That's what, I guess, the meta is right now. God, it's so bad. It's so, it's so bad. Don't worry. I am not a fool. I do not think that what we are about to try and do is going to be good. That's not what I'm thinking. But I am thinking that we can try and do something with it. I think we can make it a thing, at the very least. How do we increase the radius of our AOE? Is that possible? Shard damage, no. No, it doesn't it doesn't say anything about that. But apparently if it does two shots and it's pulling it it pulls in for the first one, maybe we're able to hit enemies with two shots when we normally can't. That's pretty cool. I'm no matter what, I am digging it. I am digging it greatly. <laughs> oh my god. The second we decide to go back to Shockwavesville is the second we have a terrible, terrible time. Shield cooldown, max hull, maybe. We honestly need all the help we can get, so. We need to go full on defense. Full on defense. <laughs> oh! Okay, 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 okay. Amp, okay. Greatly increases regenerate to the cost of reserving some of your max. I mean, maybe, <laughs> to be honest. That's, uh, that's maybe not bad. Let's get some armor stack and stuff for when we inevitably take lots and lots and lots of damage. Hidden power. All right. <laughs> we should get the thing that makes it so we're like constantly thrusting. Just like a little bit. Okay, we made it to the first boss here. First real boss, I'd say. Um. We did like a lot. <laughs> okay. Um, <laughs> what the hell? I just want to see them get, like, absorbed into us aggressively so they cannot have any hope. <laughs> to any hope to escape once they're in the radius. Hmm. Hmm. Plating. It also gives us recoil resistance. Uh, but quite frankly, I'm not sure if that's. <laughs> I believe I believe that it thinks it uh, is giving me recoil resistance. Uh oh. Oh god. Okay. Okay. All right. Um. Go in a circle. <laughs> oh! 
god! It is a challenge run for sure. If there was like Binding of Isaac style challenge runs, this would obviously be one of them. Oh my god. Like, getting as far as you can with this garbage. <laughs> what? What other benefit does it have? It had something else. Blast radius. Does this does that doesn't affect this, does it? No. It, or it says the word blast, so maybe it maybe it does. It doesn't say that it scales on blast radius, but that I guess that does not mean it does not. I don't know. Skirmish. Sure. We're we're gonna we're gonna whole crash a lot of stuff. Okay. Let's try the blast radius. Does it increase I don't know, it might. I will say that skirmish seems like probably the best thing we could have picked there. That seems really good for us. Cause they are we are running into enemies. Oh my god, leave me alone. Okay. Here's the thing. This will make it very clear. Oh, wait. Does it actually? I mean, it says the word blast in the... Oh my god. It says the word blast in there. So maybe it does. I can't believe that... Like, this is working as well as it is. I'm not saying it's working well. I gotta go. <laughs> I have to go. Um, I feel like we may have met our match here. Yeah. What's up with this? There's nothing... Nothing about a bad haul. We just... Oh, boy. We need to get in. <laughs> We've been hard countered. Okay. Uh, I'm, <laughs> I'm, gonna, I'm I'm so dead. I'm so dead. I don't know what to do about this guy. Hmm. Hmm. But, <laughs> I mean, maybe... Uh, concentrated Blast? Maybe we could do that! Okay, absolutely has an effect, right? So maybe, since they're being pulled in anyways, we use this as a benefit to, uh... Oh, God. Uh... Use it as a... <laughs> can't though this is so bad we use it as a benefit because they're not going to escape our radius anyways right understand yeah to do more dam make it so we do more damage this way i don't know i think it, i think it makes some sense i think we may mostly need to just trick the boss into standing on our little fire Okay. Okay, I think we m oh We've done it. How? Took so long. Okay, I was going to say it took so long that we're just going to summon another boss for us. Oh jeez. Oh, if we crash it, we're good. Oh. <laughs> oh no. Okay, slipstream sounds good. Or, uh, or rampage rather, but I I want this. I want to go for this like skirmishy weird build. Cause I feel like I feel like it's kind of what we can do. Oh god. Oh no. Oh mamma mia! Slowly dodge away. Okay, I'm alive. 
<laughs> Somehow. Drone hull, maybe. Let's get the armor stacks. Our, our, our drones aren't doing anything, right? We could get like um, we could oh if we had the fire uh, the fire ship that let out the little fire butt as we moved, we could just slowly move with rampage and actually kill enemies without doing anything. That would be interesting. That would be very interesting. How are we? How do we have this many points? How do we have this many points? Hidden power is very tempting. In a very stupid way. <laughs> Whoop. <laughs> I mean... The fact that we are, are not, like, insta-dying all the time is crazy to me. Wow. Baited. Get wrecked. <laughs> sure. Okay. How are you alive? What is that? <laughs> what was that? Where did those come from? What are those? Burnout reactors. <laughs> Oh my god, I'm so not mad about that. We did really weirdly well, but alas, that's gonna do it for today. Uh, I just, I've, I've, I've had that, I've had that idea in the back of my head ever since I heard it mentioned like ten episodes ago. So I, I had to, I had to get it out of my brain and onto the, onto the video. So there we go. That is that. That garbage is going to do it for today. Thank you, thank you. If you like the video, please hit the like button. Check out the channel for Roguelix and more every single gosh darn day. Oh, my God. Check out the new series that should uh, be starting today. In, I mean, if you're watching this as it goes live, in an hour. If you're watching this any other time, it'll probably be already live. Despot's Game new series is a auto chess roguelike auto battler roguelike it, that is amazingly wild and fun and good worth your eyes for sure but that is going to do it for today thank you thank you and i will see you next time bye